In this video, we're going to show you how to set up your new Epson TM P62 receipt and labeled printer. This is a mobile unit that you can take with you and, and uh, print via Bluetooth. And we're going to show you how to connect it up to your guest manager app, as well as how to install receipt paper. And we also have some label, label paper that we're going to show you how to plug in correctly. First thing you want to do is get your printer powered up by holding the power button. With that turned on, we're going to go into the iPad's device settings and we're going to go to Bluetooth. Make sure Bluetooth is on and it'll look for this printer. Here it is. All we're going to do is tap to connect to the printer. and wait for that to show connected. There we go. If you're having trouble connecting the printer via Bluetooth, there is a useful app in the App Store made by Epson called the Epson TM Utility. Use this app and follow the Bluetooth setup wizard here and this will help walk you through the steps needed to configure the printer as well as you can set auto reconnect mode via this app. Now the next step is to connect the printer to the guest manager app. So we're going to open up our app here. We're going to go to the settings menu. We're going to hit printers. And this list is going to load up and you should see your TM printer here. So now that we're connected to the printer, we're going to set up our paper. The next step is to configure our paper into the printer. There are two kinds of paper, receipt paper and label paper. These here are two inch long with black marks on the back. Let's take our printer here and pop open the tray. Now regardless of the kind of paper you're using, you want to set the width of the paper so that it's snug up inside because there are varying widths. So there's this plastic tab that you can pull out and it'll attach onto this bar here and you can see it slides back and forth to allow you to snug up the paper according to the size of it. Now in the bottom there you'll see a bunch of silver little tabs and these are what you connect the thing into. Now I usually find that the one on the end here is the right one, the second one from the end. So there's a little bit of a gap. With receipt paper, it's pretty straightforward. Pop, pop in the paper like so. And then you want to have it aligned to the left edge. Click the bottom in, slide the top in. And that's all there is to that. Now for label paper, it's a little different because we need to change the mode to peel. Peel mode is set via this bar here. There's a plastic tab that slides up and down. See this here? Now we want to have this in the up position. And the thing to slide it is over on the right hand side. There we go. We'll take our paper, pop it in the same way, line it up to the left edge, push the bottom top in first, and then slide this end over. What this does is the label will now come out pre-peeled, so you can just pull it off. After putting in our paper to the printer, we need to configure the Guest Manager app correctly to recognize that kind of paper. So we're going to go here to our Guest Manager app. We're going to open our settings again, go to Printers. And for the TM printer, right now I have Label pr Paper with uh, Blackmark installed. So I'm going to set the type to Label Blackmark, Cut Mode to Peel, 
the width to 58 millimeters, and the height set to auto. And that's everything you need to do. Now let's do a test print. Let's go to our event. Tap on a ticket. And we're going to click print. The label comes out peeled for you. You can go ahead and check it to make sure that it's aligned correctly. It looks like 